Yo, yo, good evening, everybody. So, I bought a respect movement type token. Right now, I'm acrobatics, but I want to switch it to super speed. And when you switch movement types, you got to respect all your skill points. So, I was going to take the opportunity to show you how I respect all my DPS uh, skill points on my atomic character. So, here we go. This is the token. Just right click on it choose the one that you want we want super speed graphics can thankfully handle it now so I won't have the floor uh, disappearing from underneath me but now all of our skill points have been uh, reset so let's go ahead and inspect this out first movement mode first thing we're gonna get then we're gonna go into our weapons and I have 222 skill points, I don't know how many you may have, but the first thing you always want to get as DPS is all your crits and every weapon. So that's the first thing I do as well. Little tip, just uh, press the space bar instead of having to press OK or enter or whatnot. And it makes it a lot easier. Spec out quicker. So what I'm doing is basically just going down the whole list, making sure I uh, open up this tree, this tier of bonuses by putting four points into the tree, and then getting the critical attack damages and bonuses. Okay, so now that that's finished, and we still have 145 skill points left, since we are a might based power, meaning that most of our damage is uh, is dealt through our the power of our might, the might of our powers, uh, which is the yellow numbers that come off the enemy, we want to focus on might to make sure that we get the highest DPS possible. So what we're going to do now is, uh, since we have all the trees open, we're going to concentrate on the second tier. And whichever will have might on this one, we're gonna go ahead and open that one up. Brawling is one of them. Dual pistol, no. Dual wheel, yes. You'll find might here as well. Make sure you open it up all the way. Hand blasters is precision, martial arts is might. Okay, one hander is precision, rifle is as well, shield is might. Staff is precision, two hander is might. I've done this quite a few times, so I kind of know them by memory. Alright, so now we got 115 left, and we're back down to two-handed, right? What are we going to do now? So, what we're going to do now is, we're going to start opening up weapon mastery trees, so that we can open up this uh, last tier, and get that bonus right there, the might and precision bonus. So, what you want to start doing is, Especially if you're, you know, using your advanced mechanic because you're not really using your weapon. So you don't have to spec into the actual weapon masteries for that. You can just spec into the weapon masteries to open up the trees in the bottom. You're just going to scroll all the way down, make sure you see this bottom tier. Then you're going to start specking out skill points until it lights up. And, you know, get stats that favor your play style and what you do. This is just how I spec out. Especially in the my trees, I'm gonna go ahead and focus on this health right here. And then I'll just go with power. Oh nope. Right there, that's all we needed. So now we'll do that for all the ones that Basically, we open for might since we have more skill points in those than we do in anywhere else. So here, powerful crit heal per chance. 
Let's get this right here. This right here. And let's get more power. Go slowly so that you don't spend one too many skill points when you're doing this. Because then you gotta respec all over again. Unless you could just handle that one skill point being there. Alright, martial arts is the next one. We got 93 left. So we're gonna get some defense here. We'll get the power again. And we'll get some additional power. Alright. Let's go ahead and open up that might bonus. Hand blasters, dual wield is another one. Dual wield has a lot of awesome stats for tanks too. We'll go ahead and get some defense. What else? We don't want some Dom. Let's make sure we can see that bottom row. Just gonna spread it evenly. There we go. Right here. Easy enough. 71 left. Full pistols. Balling. Okay. Here we're gonna get health. And power. There we go. Okay, so now we have all the weapon masteries that have might in the second tier opened up. So now you're going to have to, you know, go with a precision one and start opening those up. So let's just go ahead and start off with bow. Now, if you're not really going to use much precision, you can go ahead and spend those stats elsewhere. Just until those open up. But hell, this is DPS, I mean... I always put them in precision anyways. And we'll spend, I think, two points that'll let us up here. Spend one more point. There we go. Suspenseful. <laughs> Since suspenseful specking with the mad rabbit. Just fucking around. Alright. We got 43 left. Some things that we can consider when we're starting to get low is um, to go get, he head and get these uh, innates, which are just always with you. And once you start opening these up, which is uh, restraint, res restraint resistance. Which increases your 10%. That's 10% in case and root resistance. And this one is for breakout. That's 10% in pulse resistance. So you don't get knocked back, I guess. And then they start, you know, once you start spreading into these, you start regening power whenever you do a breakout, basically. Which I like, especially if you're just grinding dailies, uh, duos, solos, and formans, and sometimes don't run with a troller. This is nice to have. So, you know, that's something to consider right there. So that'd be one, two, three, four, five, six. Another thing to consider is uh, you may want to... Right now I have the shield, just simply for the fast lunge and the proximity that it gets you in when you're um, doing DPS. Uh, you could consider as well, like, opening up the tree, just, just in case, so you can have that as well. If you start getting low on skill points or you have just enough you got to do the math yourself and how, how many you got and you know uh, how you want to manage them but it's basically do it by stages no matter what skill points you got as I'm doing it in stages here as we were doing before since we're not that low yet I think we can open up about two more trees oh, so no. there is always a chance for an encore What's that? Okay, let's open up two more trees. Let's make sure we scroll all the way to the bottom so we can see. Let's get some health. Let's get some power. There we go. 
Yes, because at the end, you know, it just adds more might to what we're doing. And we got 26 left. So we already opened up. Let's go into one handed. Alright, so we got nine points left. It's not going to be enough to open another tree, so that's when I'm going to make the decision to come here. Go ahead and get that right there. Knock back recovery, this one. Let's get the full weapon combo with the shield. Just that one right there, really. Right? Oh, wait, wait, it was this one. Shit. Fuck it, we'll put it there. And then we got one left, you know what we're gonna do with it? We're gonna go ahead and get a, we'll get phase dodge just in case there's, there's tricks to be learned with phase dodge. I was being acrobatic with atomic for a long time, so. Let's see if phase dodge does anything with atomic, but basically that's it. We're down to zero skill points, expect everything out. We got the DPS ready to go. And uh, finally super speed, man. Come on, come on, gain some speed. So I didn't actually, you know, spend money on the token. It's just the actual the money that you get for being legendary. I had about 10 bucks saved up, so I was like, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and switch my movement speed. Getting tired of uh, getting slowed down in tunnels and raids and whatnot. Because... You know, if you can't find that ledge, that first jump click with the zip line, you're just jogging, man. And everybody else got their super speed on, and you're just jogging, waiting for the next wall. All right, I definitely gotta get used to this again. I'll just be farming. I'll farm some uh, some exobites for a bit, and that'll get me back into super speed mode, because it's really a speed thing. Like once you once you're in the zone with super speed, you're you're gone. Fastest movement mo movement mode in the game. Excellent for just, uh, just getting away from trouble and getting to trouble quickly and you know, resing somebody. So they went down in the wrong spot and get to them quick with that double jump. All right, though. I want to thank you for watching. I hope this helped you out, and uh, we'll see if we do the tank next. So just uh, stay tuned and hit that like if you like what you saw. Take it easy, y'all. My rabbit out.